me, it's just like, you know, your car, your car needs alignment, you know, every once in a while. And for me, I need like an alignment every day when I've been on the road and I'm traveling. Uh, my body's out of whack. So I'll turn the metronome, metronome on. This is at 90, two and four. And I'll just play scales for a little while. This is just a pattern that I, I kind of like. So that's it. So root, fifth, ninth, and going to the next octave, third, seventh, root, third. So it's really hard to do. Okay, so I wanted to give you guys some ways that you can practice sweep picking. Just to go straight up and come straight back down in time is really hard. It's, some of it is, has to do with the position. And this is, I'm picking this position because it's harder. Uh, half diminished is one that I like. And I just go up to the seventh because it's, um, it's easier to wrap it around. So I'm going to show you one more arpeggio that I kind of use to to work on switching positions and also just to to get more accurate uh, time feel when I'm when I'm sweet picking. And that's kind of practicing jumping frets and you can finish it. It's something that's kind of physically obviously it's physically hard to play but it, it, it perfectly kind of explains a lot of how I'm thinking about moving up the neck and using sweet picking with arpeggios.